Today, we are looking at Joy at Logano's 2022 Championship Shell Pennzoil Ford Mustang GT kit from Salvino's JR Models. 124 scale full detail kit. This is the first of the five that were announced to get released of the Mustang kits. Released here within the last week at the time of this video. One more is supposed to come out at the end of this month and the next three will be out in March. Each one is going to be limited to about 1,500 pieces, so if you want to get one, better act quickly. Definitely suggest pre-ordering one. The new parts in this kit will be the Mustang body, the hood, and a couple of uh, engine compartment pieces for the vent system. Everything else is going to be the same parts from the Camaro kit. And it is today's What's in the Box. Getting started with the body. You can see it's molded in a nice shade of yellow. Take a look at parts tree M, which is the new for this kit parts tree, which is the Ford Mustang parts tree. So here we have the hood and the low down for spoiler. And here this is going to be the hood vents and the uh, air box ducting for the Fords. Getting started now with parts tree B, which is the under tray parts tree with the seat some other pieces. Here the under tray you have the splitter up front, rear diffuser piece out back. Now here we have the instrument panel, instrument gauge panel piece, uh, fuel filler. Now here we have the seat, headrest, uh, intake tube that goes into the cold air box, the cold air box, bottom piece of that, uh, radiator box, two pieces, or four pieces, front and back. Moving on to parts tree C, which has some more chassis pieces. We have the uh, oil pan, left and right leg brace, seat leg brace, pedals, radiator, window net, small window, mini window net, pedal box, engine bracing. These are the hood vents. Again, you're not going to use these pieces for the Chevys or on the Fords. Excuse me. Over here we have the uh, rear wheel wells. Uh, prop shaft. And then you have the BBS wheels, two pieces. Looking at parts tree D. So we have the rear uh, bulkhead roll bar, the rear cover, clip cover. So here we have the left and right for the clip, top of the fuel cell, bottom part of the rear clip. And here we have the cockpit, uh, rear of the cockpit, the cockpit bulk hand will call it. I believe this is a communication piece here. Uh, maybe a, uh, not exactly 100 percent sure what that piece is, to be honest. Backside. And here we have the firewall, the end piece, end cap for the clip, and this other piece goes with the shelf piece. Moving on to parts tree E, which is more roll cage pieces, chassis pieces. So up here we have the top part of the roll cage and the interior door pad piece. Down here we have the transmission tunnel, a cross member roll bar, left and right side of the front clip. It's going to be the left and right of the main roll cage. Uh, another cross member bar. These are that's another that's a dash bar. Same with that. Uh, that's a angled roll bar. 
and here we have another roll bar uh, front uh, that's the uh, front sway bar piece another roll bar uh, mirror fire suppression I believe this is a cool box this piece here is going to be the ECU box taking a look at parts tree G which has some chassis pieces some engine pieces so here we have the transaxle left to right side two-piece pulleys exhaust ends and another pulley piece brake rotors with the calipers to say the brake rotor detail looks pretty good actually uh, here we have the rear bumper end cap for the transaxle uh, here we have a gear shift lever steering column axle halves shafts steering linkage rack and pinion here we have the steering wheel headers left and right and a hose i believe i've been able to find the instructions and here we have the bottom the base for the roll cage and the front bumper moving on to parts tree a which has engine pieces and suspension pieces in this corner we have the rear bumper bracing front bumper bracing rear spindles rear control arms upper and lower uh, here we have the engine block blocks heads valve covers these are all going to be just such a generic engine for I guess they're going to do it for all three makes we have the rear bell housing radiator, radiator hoses uh, front control arms dampers front spindle the coil packs uh, front accessory piece the intake the other front spindle and a set of wiring taking a look now at the clear parts tree which is going to be the same clear parts tree that's in the found in the chevy kits as well so you have your front and rear windows here you have the high down floor spoiler which is used at daytona talladega in atlanta the shark fin two pieces uh, quarter windows side window vent window now we're going to take a look at the Goodyear race roundy rounds. Now we're going to take a look at the decal sheet. You get two of them. You have, like I like to call it, the detail decal sheet for the manufacturer, and then the main decal sheet. Start with the detail decal sheet. You have the uh, headlight grill, lower uh, driving light turn signals, lower grill pieces, window trim, hood pins side skirt decals uh, some new grill decals that's kind of nice and then here we have the tail light decals tail light panel a rear diffuser type piece for the mustang with the exhaust and a license plate uh, grill decal and on the main decal sheet which is nice and full some new additions uh, that i'm seeing at least uh, here on the fords uh, you have the uh, window tear off piece there piece decal uh, jack bolt locator decals two decals for the uh, spoiler red and yellow now we're going to take a look at the instruction sheet which they made some changes it's now a generic instruction sheet no more kit specific which i mean makes sense really the only changes are going to be just the body And yes, you're going to get yourself some color mesh paint for this one. You can. James Fisco Finishes does do Pennzoil Yellow, which is what I used for the Gen 6 Joy Logano build I did. And we have an add on here. Print it out. And the placement guide down here. I have a feeling this might be what's going to, they're going to be doing moving forward for each of the kits. 
So that, my friends, is going to do it for this look at Joey Logano's 2022 Shell Pennzoil Ford Mustang GT kit from Salvino's JR Models. On that note, thank you guys for watching.